Hello everybody, welcome back to Tourist Media's Tutorials. And today we're going to look at this uh, effect that we have here. It's a text effect. Uh, sort of uh, advanced version of my uh, 3D effect. So we're uh, just going to start right out, okay. Uh, select your text tool over here and write your text. There we go. I recommend that you use uh, some of uh, 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 very bold text because uh, if not, you're gonna if, if you use a text like this, the effect doesn't show as well and it becomes a little distorted and yeah. So here I have a both a bold and uh, a little bit of artistic text. Just gonna hit OK and we are starting. We're going into the lenders blending options and we're going to choose some gradation overlay here click on the gradation and change to a more suitable color let's see uh, the green here and a very very light green here that's looking rather cool yeah Okay, remember this is the effects we're going for. So, and we're going back to blending tools. Sorry, just had to remind myself what I was going to do. We select stroke, take about two, one maybe, yeah, one pixel. Choose a color, a dark green here. Don't if you choose black, if it, uh, you get it's not so pretty. So just choose dark, dark green, like that. Okay, so far so good. And we're going to select this by holding down control and hitting the layer. And we have a nice little selection. Create a new layer down here. There we go. We go to select, modify and expand. We are now going to expand our selection here. Um, to uh, make an effect. 5 pixel. What did I do here? Oh, okay, yeah, right, sorry. <laughs> okay, we have our new layer here. I'm gonna choose two different colors. One rather bright here, and one extremely bright of the same color. In there, I think. Choose our gradation tool over here. There we go, gradation tool. If you hold down shift, you can notice that my uh, gradation tool here only wants to go in lines. Only 90, de 90 degrees or 45 degrees. A little trick to get uh, the gradation quite uh, right. So, take about there. No, that was wrong. You want to have the uh, lightest color uh, towards the top of the picture. Okay, mm, we move our other layer on top of it like that. And we're going to blend options on our yellow background here. We take blending options, stroke, put in a little stroke here, maybe two pixels with a dark, 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 very dark, very dark yellow. Doesn't even seem like yellow. Okay, there we go. This effect by itself is quite cool also, but uh, now begins the fun part. We are now going to take this yellow, um, no, this top layer here, and to choose our move tool, and, and we're going to add the 3D effect. Hold down your alternative key, uh, it's alt, and you push upwards on your uh, arrows, and right, and up, and right, and up, and right, and up, and right, and up, and right. Okay, now it was a little bit extreme, but just to make you see the effect. As you can see here, when you move your uh, layer by uh, holding down the alternative, the uh, Photoshop makes a copy of that one that you move. As you can see here, so we have 11 copies here. Mark the... Uh, not the last one, 
this is the last one, the one on the top. You mark the rest and just merge it for just to make it easier. Uh, and you can uh, change now the style of this top layer. That's the, that's why you want to have the uh, the top layer uh, so that you can change the effect. But we are not gonna do that now. That's just for your own purpose. And we're going to do the same to the uh, the background. Hold down alternative, press up, left, up, left, up, left. Okay, that was a little too much. Uh, okay. Okay, I kind of ruined it now, but okay. Take the same here. Merge. And there you have it. This is our top. There uh, you have the top layers. I'm just going to merge them so that you can see the effect that we have here. And this one, merge it. And this was how that yeah, looks quite the same, approximately. Yeah, I'm Taurus, uh, from TaurusMedia.net. Hope that you enjoyed it. And uh, please give me feedbacks, comments, anything. Maybe uh, this uh, helped you design or make something cool. I would really like to see it. And I hope to see you again. Ciao.